I was born with hair on my chest, a gleam in my eye, to latch on to a breast. I cut my own umbilical cord with my razor sharp teeth. Then I drove home and my mom rode on in the back seat. I didn't go through puberty, puberty went through me. And it was never even awkward, cause I made it happen instantly. If you address a letter to man and put it in the mail, rest assured I'd receive it, but I ain't gonna be your pen pal. My time is too valuable for that. I'll be too busy working a jackhammer. You're a mama boy. I was born in an arctic cave and adopted by wolves. That's how I was raised. I didn't drink milk. I suckled the fangs of venomous snakes. I killed the first man that I met with just my firm handshake. I potty trained myself. You're still bed wetting. I smell like charcoal when I'm sweating and was the best man at my own wedding. Search Google Images for masculinity. Feel free to Photoshop your face on that image of me. Creative Commons pump. Meanwhile, I'll be adjusting some really large nuts. I rise before the sun, screw circadian rhythm. I bathe with sandpaper and my underwear is thinner. My shade with a box cutter, blindfolded as well. Cause if I look in the mirror, I intimidate myself. I got no need for sleep. I never shut my eyes. I type bitchy noise while I memorize Apache war cries. The sun comes up when I tell it I'm ready. Then I trim my nose hairs with a razor sharp machete. I'm manly cause I'm so handy, even my feet are hands. I built a hobbit house for a homeless man without using any plans. My kid's jungle gym has a full-size trapeze and I modified my garden hose to dispense nacho cheese. I'm handy too, I brought out my bathroom exhaust fan into your bedroom. I write incisors of Phillips head screwdriver. I made my son deck into a holodeck where I hang out with MacGyver. My GPS gets its sense direction from me. I can drive 10 hours without stopping and take a leak. I don't avert my eyes when I pass roadkill and I teach an online course in parallel parking skills. When my car breaks down, I don't call a mechanic. I just open the hood and then I stare at it. And then I call a mechanic. But I won't be cheated. He's not gonna talk me into repairs and I just know that I need it. I can sleep alone in the woods without a tent. I might get a little scared, but then I get over it. I tie knots the Eagle Scouts had even heard of. Like the double overhead figure eight fisherman's burger. Well, I got the know-how to properly grill every part of a cow. And when I taste the veggie patty, I just spit it out. I'll break your face with a plate if you want it well done. And your wife is always asking me to toast her buns. Uh, fellas? Everything all right here? Uh, yeah, he was just cleaning something off my shirt. Yep. Got it. Okie dokie. You guys have a great day. I'm too much man for a manicure. I don't even have cuticles. For the sake of convenience, I keep a urinal in my cubicle. I can barefoot ski. I can smell the fear of bees. I threw up in my mouth the one time that I watched Glee. I am my own boss. My middle name is Hoss. I don't even know what it feels like to sit with my legs crossed. I've never been shopping. I don't remove pizza toppings. I can tell the age of a mountain goat just by sniffing this dropping. with hotties to play fake army. I tried Dungeons and Dragons once and I died of boredom, but I'll still kick your Assassin's Creed post-mortem. Mario Party's the only one you get invited to. Your life is like Skyrim, an endless quest of solitude. Ooh, you beat Angry Birds. You're not a gamer. 
gamer cause you battle your friends with words. You click on cute icons, I execute commands. Do you really need a genius to teach you garage band? I landed the first raffle copter and took an orphans when I was 12 cause I'm an early adopter. I can wear Google Glass without looking like a dweeb. Okay, maybe not, but I can yelp with some good footing. You need 16 gigs of RAM to watch a Steve Jobs doc? I keep an actual RAM in my PC. His name is Bob. I'm a new console. Your face is birth control. I troll bony sites. You look like an actual troll. I'm fluent in C++. See, you just suck. Can your iPhone auto-correct your dumb haircut? Hold on a second. Let me tweet this infographic I made that illustrates the fact you'll never get to procreate. I just haven't met a woman of a high enough caliber. The only dates you have are on your Google Google calendar. You're losing this battle. Your phone sword won't help. In the future, you'll randomly access this memory and crap yourself. Did I mention I felt a dancing robot? No one gets a Shatner about their skinny beans. Do you even know what URL means? You don't know what you're talking about. You know, you are a classic example of the inverse ratio between the size of the mouth and the size of the brain. Really sorry about You know what? Don't worry about it. Yeah. Everything's okay. Cause I'm on vacation. We spent 14 hours on that sand couch. Cause I'm on vacation. At least we're not back at our job. Which is at an ice cream sandwich factory. We need it. We want it. Vacation. We own it. Surf, beach, palm, tree. Got no worries. Typically, I ride a bike by myself, but I'm on vacation. I'm going to ride with someone else. Yeah, we rented a double bike. Two men on a double bike. I've always wondered what a double bike ride feels like. I think there's something in my eye, but it's okay. Because I'm still on vacation. I left my fashion sense at home. It's time to get our ever t-shirt on Not willing to pay anything he wants me to pay Cause he can make a shirt say anything I want it to say Birthday girl, first cousin, buck wild Dustin, I love dolphin, team mom, dog person, Steve Jobs Uh, you got a little something on your face I know, but it's still okay Cause I'm on vacation I think he misspelled the word vacation But that's cool On vacation, I spend cake on figurines and keepsakes. This decorative plate, I'ma use that. This sand dollar, I need that. This snow globe, I'ma use that. This ink pen, do you see that? I can't see it all, but I'm still on vacation. I don't eat fudge much in my daily routine. But on vacation, I judge, but then become a fudge fiend. I think I love fudge. I think I'm feeling queasy. I think this fudge has been drugged. Who would do such a thing? <laughs> Turns out these ladies are really running this boutique as a front for an identity theft ring. And now they are dragging all their bodies straight up out of this lobby into the back where they're gonna steal everything. But it's still okay, cause I'm on vacation. Right now they're applying for a car loan, it's us. Good for them. No cash, no phone, no, no obvious, obvious way, way to get, get home. home. It's time to turn to the only skill that we can fall back on. Selling ice cream sandwiches at the corner of this street. Twelve dollars for a dozen or fifty cent a piece. Don't question where we got the ice cream from. Just step right up and sample some cookies, the nicest ice cream, the whitest. But I think what's inside this is a mutated virus. We might have just unleashed the zombie apocalypse. But it's still okay. And why are they in this music video at all? This is so cliche. Well, technically, these are time traveling zombies, which is slightly more original. Everything is great. I'm a hey! For me, it's honesty or I'm not interested. Totally. <laughs> That's what we need, man. Yeah. 
We need more honesty in our lives. We just tell so many lies to so many people. And now we need to go back to each one of them and come clean. Last week I saw you in the lobby passing through. You said, hey, how you doing? I said, pretty good, man. And you, well, that wasn't true. I was actually doing pretty bad, having just received some unfortunate news from my dad. He had invested my inheritance in his new business plan. That plan was taking teens to the prom and a fleet of used minivans. So at that moment, I didn't really care how you were doing, and I don't remember your name. That's why I called you man. The other night at midnight, you called me on the phone. You asked me if you woke me up, but I said no. But the truth is, I was in the deepest sleep of my life, having the most realistic dream I was flying. In the International Human Flying Championship, your sister was there and was about to give me a kiss. That's when you called me and asked me how to say the naughty. Listen closely. It's Mjolki. said romantic night out you broke the silence by asking what are you thinking about i said how much i love you but that's not true i mean i do love you i just don't think like you do my brain's a sophisticated department completely disconnected apartments and in that particular moment i was thinking about sports Last night when I was quiet, you asked me, what's wrong? I looked into your eyes and said, nothing at all. That's not exactly true. I'm actually starting to resent you and the work you're pouring into. Your taxidermy petting zoo. You haven't called me Pookie Pie in over four months. Do you want to preserve us or this dead dog? Yesterday, you pulled me over and asked if you had any idea how fast you were going. I said, oh, no, officer. I didn't even see you. But I did see you. And I was going 72. And then for this soldier, my right speaker was blown. And for the preceding 10 miles, my left speaker was on. I had no intention of ever turning left. You may recall I gave a testimonial for your product. I said the face cave in no way makes me look idiotic. I feel like I'm in a cave even though I'm not really in a cave. Because the only thing in the cave is my face. To tell you the truth, face caves are hostile. Unless you really like to lag mice up your nostrils. You know your terms and conditions agreement. When I was updating my software, I didn't read it. Felt so good. Studies show that ladies like a man with a guitar. But I don't want to learn guitar, cause I've heard that it's hard. But I can learn how to hold it and move my hand Just enough so you might think that I might be in a band I can also play mouth guitar while playing fake guitar That's what women want I don't play this saxophone but I've heard that it never fails for a woman to love a sax playing man So I bought one at a yard sale It looks incredibly complicated with all these moving parts But all I gotta do is move my fingers and throw back my head to speak to your heart That's what women want I don't technically have a job But I've heard the ladies lie a man who doesn't live at home And drive a car instead of a bike So I call Jack this convertible And I shoplifted this suit And I know that it impresses you When I'm driving and talking on my Bluetooth No, 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 I already have a meeting at 3 but You know what, go ahead and schedule it I'll take it from the office and the other one from Skype But I still gotta make my racquetball game at 3 times. That's what women want I don't have the capacity to feel emotions for others because I'm a sociopath, I never knew my mother. But I've learned how to mimic human feelings and make women think that I care. I find it goes a long way to just tell a girl you like her hair. 
Hi, how are you? I absolutely love being with you. You smell nice. You make me the happiest man in the world. You can trust me. That's what women want. That's what the ladies like. That's what chicks need. That's what females prefer. That's what honeys desire. That's what babes fancy. That's what girls are into. That's what women want. Have you lost weight? 